Hey guys, Lautype Crow here. So you've just bought your state-of-the-art LG TV and are eager to use the smart features. However, you're hit with this. The LG TV unable to load user agreements error. When you click on the dialog box, the circle of dread keeps spinning until it spews the words a server error has occurred. And that's it. Or so you thought. Because I went on the internet and I found this. The LG support chatbot recommends that we 1. Connect to a hotspot. To check for software updates and number four, reset the TV. And I'm here to tell you that none of those options work. The steps resolve this issue is as follows. Open advanced Wi-Fi settings, turn off IPv6, set DNS to 8.8.8.8, .8 go to privacy and terms, and then accept the user agreements. I know, it's quite a lot to take in. No need to fret, just press the settings button on your TV remote or just navigate to it on screen. And then go to general settings and scroll down until you reach network. Click on it and then go for the Wi-Fi connection option and go to other network settings, scroll down to advanced Wi-Fi settings and then first off turn off IPv6 and then go to the edit option at the bottom and turn off set automatically. Now scroll all the way down to the page until you reach the DNS server option, clear the DNS server which is there currently and set the new one as 8.8.8.8. .8 I'll clear that and I'll enter this, enter and then press connect again and as you can see it's now connecting and it's connected to the internet now now go back to the home page or the home screen click on the user, user agreements if it's there on the home page or else go to settings and all settings and scroll down to support and from support you'll see at the very bottom privacy and terms click on that and then you'll see the user agreements click on that and then you can read through this at your own will and choose pick and choose which one you want to agree or not agree to or you can just press or select the select all option at the bottom I'll just do that and then click on agree this brings you back to the home page and now you need to sign in to your LG TV so click on the LG account sign in option I suggest you sign up on your phone or computer for a better and easy experience and then sign in on the TV itself so put all your details in and click on sign in it's going to ask you to put a nickname so do that and then as you can see all the apps are now on the home page and all the things just Prime Video, Apple TV etc are starting to load up and the thumbnails are there on screen. If you open an app such as YouTube, it's going to open, it's going to ask you permissions, you can click on OK and then it's going to start updating the app. It's updating YouTube as you can see. It's pretty fast I would say. and. There you go, it's been successfully updated and to show you guys that it is indeed working, I'm going to search for the LG OLED TV test. So I'll just type that in. If it still does not work, the other solutions to the issues to connect via Ethernet, connect to a phone hotspot, update software via USB, soft reset the TV and as a last resort reset the TV to factory settings. Thanks for watching and see you guys in the next one.